Good morning, and thank you for joining us for devotions here at Lynn Valley Baptist Church. This morning, I want to look at one verse, and that is 1 Thessalonians chapter 5, verse 11. And that verse says, Encourage one another and build each other up, just as in fact you are doing. You know, loving other people includes encouraging them. Encouragement is such a great gift because it helps us to carry on. It helps us to reach our goals, and it helps us not to grow weary in doing good. For some reason, even though encouragement can be one of the easiest things we can do to help somebody else, we don't do it enough. And we know that a word of encouragement can go a long way. When people are sick, when results don't come as soon as we want them to, when someone attempts something for God, when you are blessed by someone's service, when someone has exhibited courage, when faith seems to be lost or seems to be failing, when a mistake has been made, people need to be encouraged. One time I had preached a message in a church and uh, when the service was over I was shaking hands and there was a man who came to me that I greatly admire and he said, you know Tim, I was going to tell you that that was a great message but I really didn't feel like you needed any encouragement. I let him know very quickly that we all need encouragement. And a preacher especially needs encouragement after he preaches a message. Some Sunday messages more than others. We all need encouragement. We need it for uh, all kinds of reasons. And we need to be getting it from fellow believers. And we're admonished to encourage each other. So I want to encourage you to try to find someone today who needs to be encouraged and to send them a text or give them a call or send them an email or a letter. You know, a word fitly spoken goes a long way. Just be obedient. When there's a nudge of the Holy Spirit, just contact that person or tell that person, maybe it's your server at a restaurant, and just let them know how much they mean to you how much their service meant to you, or how much their attempt to do something meant to you. They didn't have to do the most perfect job in the world for you to give them a word of encouragement. And I want to encourage you today to stay strong in the Lord, to keep serving Him, and not to give up, even though at times it seems as if our results are not coming as quickly as we want them to come. Have a great day. God bless.